Here's a quick walkthrough on how to uh, set up this mini project three in Kaggle. Uh, so the first thing I want to do is download the notebooks. I'm in here, I'm going to go here, go download and download the Iron Python notebook file and uh, download this file. Um, then I'm going to go to this Kaggle challenge and you have to create a login in Kaggle. So if you don't have one, you are, well, actually you can use your Google sign in. That's what I just used. So we'll just sign in with Google. And I'm signed in now up here. And I wanna make sure I'm in the pet finder uh, adoption prediction challenge. Uh, that's what this link should. If you're not there, go to competition or just search for a pet finder. That there's a couple, make sure you wanna do this. This is a three year old competition. So uh, that we're doing uh, here. Um, and then I'm gonna to go to code. And there's uh, other people's notebooks here that you can actually look at, but we're gonna create a new notebook here. Under, again, I went to code and then clicked on new notebook. Now I'll create this new notebook. Um, and now I'm going to, I'm in here and I should be, the input should be set to the pet finder adoption uh, stuff. So this should be the data for the pet finder because I started in there. Uh, and then I'm going to, this is just a blank notebook. So I'm going to import my notebook uh, here. So I'm going to um, okay, I had to wait. It, it has to create the sample notebook here. So it creates a sample notebook for you to use uh, here and just kind of tells you where the inputs are going to be uh, in Kaggle slash inputs. Uh, but now once that is, I can go to import a notebook once that's there. And I can just grab my notebook file out there. Um, Okay, so I'm grabbing the file I downloaded, importing that into here. So here are my files imported. Um, and I should be able to run like this first uh, area, uh, import my libraries. Now the next one I have to change is where we're getting the data. So if I scroll down here, there's two URLs. One is to, when we're in Kaggle and the other one when we're out, we use something called GitHub. And right now, our data folder variable is set to the GitHub folder. I'm going to comment that out uh, and instead uncomment this one where my data folder is now going to use this Kaggle uh, folder here. Sorry, scrolled wrong. Um, there, so it should start using the Kaggle folder for everything. And again, it should work if this is set up all uh, right. Um, you, uh, to get submissions here, you also have to turn the internet off. So I'm gonna turn that off uh, here uh, because we don't need the internet uh, for this. Um, and then I can run this uh, cell here. It should be able to access the data here. Um, and then I can actually run this whole notebook uh, for us, uh, for it to, to do things. Um, oh, when you save this, there's two different options. One is it will uh, run your whole notebook and save and, and share the, submit the results. Um, and that takes a while. Another thing that you can do is a quick save. So I often just do a quick save initially while I'm working with this. And now I'll make sure kind of everything's working. And then later on, you'll do a full save. And so the quick save will just take a, a couple minutes, but the longer save will run through the whole notebook and all the training and stuff and do the submission for this uh, stuff. Now, when you're done with this, if you've done a submission uh, for this, so you've actually done a full save uh, here, not a quick save, but the save, run, and commit, um, that'll uh, upload a submission uh, for it. And you can go back to your um, Pet Finder challenge. And we've gone under code here and looked at those. Um, here, but you can also look at your submissions. 
So if you go back here, you can go under the leaderboard and you can look at, click on my submissions. Um, and you should be able to see your submissions here. Now, your, since the challenge is over, you're going to have to go to late submissions to see this. Um, and then you should see, um, oh, I guess that's, a, that's where you can do your submission uh, in here. Uh, if it doesn't show up uh, there. So you can do a late submission and see your results. So hopefully this will help.